Can I just say that uh, Colin mentioned some of the other unions here today. Uh, one of my jobs is to pass on to you from the Victorian Trades or Council Executive full support for this rally, full support for your campaign for TAFE justice. <laughs> of other unions that weren't mentioned, the Australian Services Union and the Independent Teachers Union are also here, I can see their banners. Uh, but going back to uh, who, who also Colin mentioned, uh, the CFMU, the ETU and the AMWU and the Plumbers Union etc, why are they here besides general support against a bad government? They're here because they recognise skills Vocational training are very, very important to their memberships. That's why they're here, because they're backing their own membership up. Yeah. <laughs> vocational and education and training is crucial to our nation and to our state. We hear all sorts of politicians, doesn't matter who they are, talking about how important dealing with the skills shortage is all about. They rave and rant about it. But what's their answer? That's bring in overseas migrants and rip them off rather than train our own people to do the jobs properly in this country. We need the TAFE system. We need it more than ever because of the way the economy is going, not less. Yet what Mr Bayou has decided to do is gut the TAFE system when we needed it the most to develop our great country. Right. This man is not a visionary. Let me tell you about Mr Bayou. He's up there watching now. Yeah. Give him a wave. Yeah. He's very interested in what's going on here today because he's realising now he's bitten off more than he can do. The real problem Mr Bayou's got is this. He's not thinking about the state he was elected to govern. He's not being pro-Victorian, pro-Victorian workers, pro-Victorian citizens. What he's playing is games with his colleagues interstate. Mr O'Farrell, Mr Newman and of course Mr Abbott. He's doing that wider game plan of the Conservatives about how to wreck this country and bring it down to its knees. He's got to get into back into thinking about Victoria. If he doesn't do that, if he doesn't think about us, then he should quit the job. There's a slogan in front of me that many of you won't be able to see. It talks value, cutting education and building prisons. Here's my reversal of that. We should have education, affordable education for all, and the wreckers of TAFE should go to prison. I'll finish on this. You've got the full support of the Victorian Union movement. Keep up your fight and you will win. Thank you. Yeah.